okay? Are you okay? He's leaving. Who? He said he may be back soon to see me. If he's leaving for work, I'm sure I'll be fine. Really? Yeah. Hey, look, you gotta have hope. He's gonna take her with him. nice to me. Maybe I just let things go because I want to feel loved. isn't too far. Maybe he will take his son with him too. If I even get to meet I'm so sorry, but I've got to take this call. I hope it all works out for you. Where are you? Al, about to meet Gabe. Cool. So, where are you? God, this ain't about to be a third world situation. I'll see you later. Okay. Maybe we can meet up later. Hey, Lyra, is everything okay? Yeah. I just wanted to hang out. Could, um do with a friend right now okay well when gabe gets here i'll let him know it's got to be a short one and then i'll come straight to you no you don't need to do that just take your time and i'll see you later yeah only if you're sure i mean something's death all out Are you going to tell me now or later? Is everything okay? Let's talk later, yeah. Tell Gabe I said hi. I'll see you soon, Sarah. Okay. Who was that? Is everything all right? I'm not sure if it is. Hey, no, don't worry, it's not with me. I'm okay. Yeah, that's good. I can't say the same about Lyra. Was that who you on the phone to? What did she say? Nothing, just wanted to see me. But clearly something's up. And... I'm starting to think you might know what it's about. These are for you. Thanks. Yeah, I thought you might like them. You know, I don't even like flowers like that. They die quickly. That was insensitive. Okay. I'm sorry. Thank you for the gift. It's cool. <laughs> You're still gonna have to tell me what you know about Lyra. There's nothing to tell. There's nothing to tell, or you just don't want to tell me. 
Look, if my friend's in trouble, then I've got to go help her. I'm sorry, Gabe, but I've got to go. Wait. You're my boyfriend and she's my best friend. Why are you doing this? You need to tell me what's going on right now or I'm gonna break up with you. No! Sarah, don't say that. Well, then talk to me. Look, I don't want to assume the worst, but you're making this really hard. No, no. don't come any closer. You need to tell me what's happened between you two. I can't believe you. How can Lyra do this to me? Look, nothing's ever happened between me and Lyra. You need to tell me what's happening or I swear I'm gonna call Lyra and I'm gonna go. You don't understand. I would never. Look, I love you, Sarah. Okay? It's just... I just don't, I just don't know. Don't know what? I... I'm so sorry. Sorry about what? Gabriel! Dad has a job in Cork. I don't know how you feel about the whole long distance thing, but it's killing me knowing that I have to be away from you. I, I already told Lira's family about me staying with them for a while, just so I can get back on my feet. You know the issues already my parents have been having. I have to be there with them to make sure they settle. You're not coming back. No, I am. I just don't know when. I already have some stuff left in Lira's garage, so... I will come back as soon as I can. expecting you to wait for me but I will be back as soon as I can Why would you 
did you take him away from me? So sorry, Zero. <laughs> I will come back to you. I promise. <laughs> You should have picked up. What's happened now? I can't help you if you don't tell me what's going on. I know you can be dramatic. What's the manual done this time? Hey, hey, hey. I didn't know it was that bad. I'm sorry, come here. His son is free. It's okay. Go on. I've been your support worker for almost a year now. But I do consider you a friend. I don't really agree with what you're pursuing with Emmanuel, but I do want you to be happy. I hope his son got for him. Girlfriend, he 
if he's moving to Cork. That might be. He's moving to Cork. He said... All of his parents are going. He doesn't love her. to help. Look at me. completes me. Come on, let's get you home. to see you again, Daniel. Likewise. Why are you smiling? It's nothing. Clearly it's something. Go on. The pouting is... It's cute. Cute? I don't know how Sarah would feel about you calling me cute. Actually, I said your pouting was cute. If I were to use a word to describe you, it would be beautiful. The pretty privilege doesn't work on me. Whatever, Daniel. She can wait. It's not Sarah. So who is it then? It's not a person. SMP, even though the film coming out today. And I just want to catch the premiere, that's all. Well, I don't know about that, but whatever. I called you here for a reason. Yeah, you did. What's up? What are your intentions for Sarah? I had a feeling that's what this would be about, but at the same time, I still wasn't ready for that. Well, Taf, tell me. Well, um, I just want her to be happy and enjoy the time we spend together. I I'd never do anything to take advantage of her. I wouldn't force her to do anything she doesn't want to do. Well, you do realize she has a boyfriend. She's never mentioned anyone. Well, I'm not making it up. You really like her, don't you? Look, I never brought you here to upset you. I'm, I'm not upset. 
I just wanted to make sure you weren't taking advantage of Sarah, but it turns out you're an amazing guy. Yeah, thanks. Look, I, I never meant to upset you. I'm not upset. Okay. So, maybe we can keep this between us? Yeah, uh, okay. Yeah, that's... That's cool, isn't it? Okay, sweet. You just want to take up all my time. Nah. I just want to give you all of mine. Oh, Those flowers are beautiful. Oh, thank you. Whoever the lucky lady is. Mm. Yes, sorry. <laughs> just very lucky. Well, if you must know, yeah, must. Well, she's got her issues. But who doesn't? But she's... Absolutely... Outstanding. What's up? someone to talk about me like this <laughs> look you're a beautiful woman and I'm sure a man will be smart enough to realize just how special you are soon enough I really hope it works out for you too Mr. Smooth Talker <laughs> but if it doesn't you can help me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I hope it works out too. Take care of yourself. Bye. Uh, I thought you'd be happy to see me. You know I am. Then why the face? Sarah, you know you can talk to me. Out of all people, what made you think you could fool me? I see you. I know you do. Like nobody else ever could. Exactly. So what's up? I don't want to talk about it now. All the flowers for me. My favorite. For my favorite. <laughs> You're so silly. <laughs> what? Since when didn't you love my silliness? Oh, God. Yeah, yeah, I I don't know about using big words like that. You love it. <laughs> Whatever, Dan. Let's go. Wait, wait, wait. I'm glad I have you feeling a little bit better. But you still have to tell me what had you feeling that way earlier. It's nothing. Sarah. Daniel. Look, I said I don't want to talk about it. Now can we please just go? Okay. Cool. Don't don't do that. I didn't do anything. Look, stop. You know, I can't deal with your sarcasm. <laughs> and I shouldn't have to deal with your mood, but here we are. 
You know what? I, let's talk about okay, it. Okay, let's. James coming home soon. Uh, that's that's okay. That's that's fine. That's cool with you. Yeah, that's that's cool with me. Really? Uh, Sarah, Sarah, you don't have to do that. Yeah, you don't have to do this. W what do you mean? I'm the one that made a mistake, not you. Dan, I didn't mean it like that, I just... That's fine. It's fine, I mean, it's not like we're together anyway. don't have to go. No, I'm gonna go then. What would you do if you were me? Sarah, it's not up to me. Yeah, but what would you do if you were me? I don't know. I didn't meant to do this to you, Dan. Look, I don't want to say it because I'm not going to be able to hold back, but don't get to be this happy forever, Sarah. Oh, I'm going to go before I make this any worse. You know what? I'm just going to call Lyra to come and get you. No, don't. Uh, please. Just let me do this. Don't get, don't to, get be to be this happy, happy forever. forever. Hey Dan. I was thinking about what we spoke about and yeah, it's totally cool with me. Maybe we can meet up tonight. You know, just chill. it will be go that man it's not god yeah, boy. i'm here for you this isn't about how i feel about daniel this is about being here for you go on sarah I messed up. I, I shouldn't have let it come to this. But it has. And it's time to start healing. It's time to move on. Move on? How could you even say that? God, I can't believe you. Well... I guess it doesn't matter what I think, because you've made a choice, and now it's time to let him go. I don't 
want to feel this way. I just don't know how to make this stop. He'd made the worst curry. Like, what the hell was that? I told him I'd try and teach him how to make a better one. I need to go to him. Stop! Enough! I can't help you if you keep trying to find ways to get back to him. You don't understand, Lyra. He taught me so much about myself. I don't even know what's there. Well, thank you, Daniel, but now it's time to move on. I'm never going to find anyone that understands me the way he does. Well, I'd like to think that as your best friend, I understand you in ways he doesn't. I'm not saying any of this to hurt you or to make him look better. It's just... It's what it is. Well, even if you aren't trying to hurt me, it still hurts. This hasn't been easy for any of us. Nothing is going to change what we've shared. You can't even just be here for me. You came to be here for me. Well, once again, I need you. I may not be your whatever he is, but I'm meant to be your best friend. And you never consider how any of this makes anyone feel. I'm gonna be able to figure it out all today, so let's just. If I could use a drink, how about you? I appreciate what you're trying to do, but I'm a horrible person. Yeah, it's true, I am. I'm my best friend's hair trying to help me through a difficult time and all I can think about is this guy. <laughs> no. It's okay. I'm gonna go. Yeah.